student developer here and today we're doing a revisited version of how to get god mode in any game um i guess i uh, i realized that my my previous video on how to get god mode in any game was a little bit confusing and uh, i made a couple mistakes so i wanted to do uh, a revisited version and this time we're going to be using zombies so you guys can get a a better image of what uh what god mode looks like so let's go ahead and get into it um this isn't single player but let's say you was doing this in multiplayer just make sure your anti-cheat is disabled um if you don't know how to check if your game has anti-cheat or if you don't know if your game has anti-cheat uh don't apply cheats to the game so let's go ahead and attach our our application to cheat engine let's do it so in zombies it's, it's pretty much the same with multiplayer as far as health values go our health is is a is a hundred so it is a four byte so whenever we search for our health whenever we search for our health we're going to since we already know our health value we're going to type it in because we already know what it is no I'm not. so Go ahead and let's do our first scan. 100. Okay. So, what we're going to do is get hit by a zombie. And when we get hit, we're going to decrease our value. So, that's what we're going to do. So, let's get hit by a zombie. Hopefully I don't get double hit. So decrease and then let's increase it back to a hundred. Let's get hit again. So let's decrease and increase it back to a hundred. Let's do it one more time. Shoot a couple, couple of the zombies here. Let's get hit one more time. Decrease. And increase back to 100. So we have our health value. We have our health value. So let's alter it. Let's change it. We're going to test each one until we find our static. Well, all of them are static, but until we find our, the one that changes our health. So let's add the first three here. So I may die a couple times and that's fine uh but yeah let's let's continue on so we're gonna lock the first one and you activate you're freezing it and we're gonna change our value to to a, a high number very high number and let's see nope that's not it wait let me see Mm. Hmm. I think in zombies when you when you change your value for one it changes it for all since you're in a, a single player but we can still try it we can still try it let's see yep we have god mode so that that is god mode in zombies in a nutshell so let's go ahead and delete these two values here we don't need that and like I stated in previous tutorials if it's indicating green, if your address is indicating green, that means it is static. When you restart the game, you can remodify your value. If it is black, that means it's dynamic, which means if you restart your game, you, you cannot remodify your value and you will have to do a pointer scan for that address um, in order to modify the game after you restart it. So let's rename this to God mode. I'm gonna show you this one last time. Go ahead and end the video. So let's go over here. As you can see, we have God mode. We cannot die. That is how you get God mode in almost any game. Almost any game because different, the reason why I say almost because different game stores health values at, at a different data type. So you may have to search, change, your your data type when you when you do a scan so in this game 
it, it could be a four bite, but in another game, it, it could be a float, double, or uh, possibly a bite. And, but that, that may be rare. So that is how you get God mode in almost any game. This is Student Developer, and I'm out.